Hi everyone, Catherine here with Catherine's Plate, where today we are going to make pizza with a twist. And when I say twist, we're going to put it together using non bread and other items that I got from Trader Joe's during our haul last week. So are y'all ready? Let's put these pizzas together. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and just show you everything that we're going to be using. Now, I have my tandoori naan bread. This is a traditional Indian style flatbread, and there was four to a pack. Now, you can get naan bread anywhere, y'all, okay? When I say Trader Joe's, that's just where I picked it up from. So you can get it at any store. Now, I'm using the Trader Joe's fresh pizza sauce that came out of their refrigerator section. We have some oil here, so we can saute up our vegetables. I'm using the Trader Joe's shredded mozzarella cheese right here. Now I have some baby bell peppers and all these pretty little colors in there. And I also have a jalapeno pepper in there and we'll see how much will go in there. <laughs> if it was my way, there would be none, but my husband wants some on his pizza, so we'll work with that. Got an onion, a garlic clove that we're just gonna kind of mince down and cook in with the onion. Now we have some gourmet pepperoni that I'm gonna be putting on the pizza also. And then also I'm gonna be using this sweet Italian pork sausage that we're gonna break up and cook first before we put it on the pizzas. All right, y'all, we're gonna get started. Let's go. All right, y'all, so the first thing I'm doing is I'm just gonna go ahead now and chop up my peppers, my onions, and mince my garlic and jalapeno. Now, I've got my oven preheating at 450 degrees, so we go ahead and have that ready because once we saute this up, it's all gonna come together pretty quickly. All right, so I'm using these cute little bell peppers here and just slicing them is all I'm doing. Now, I'm thinking about one and a half peppers for each um, non bread there. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. All right, y'all, my son just got back from going to San Francisco, California, and if you can see, he brought me a nice shirt, right? <laughs> All right, so he had a great trip, and we looked at pictures and just heard about everything that he did with his friends while they were there. They had a great time. All right, so I've got the peppers chopped up that I want to use. Now we're just going to chop up about half of an onion here. Now I'm just going to really just kind of slice these really thinly, just like that. Now if you don't want to put onions in there, you don't have to put onions in there. We kind of like our onions cooked for our pizza with the peppers. All right, so I got the onions all chopped here. I'm going to go ahead now and take my garlic clove I'm just going to lay the flat edge of my knife on it, and then I'm just going to slap it down a little bit, peel all that skin off. There we go, looking just like that. All right, I'm going to go ahead now and cut these in half. All right, now I'm just going to take my mincer and put some cloves in, and then just kind of crush them out there like that and then just wipe it off right here on the board we're ready for it perfect that's just what we need right there all right y'all i'm going to go ahead and get my pot going here put it on so we can start sauteing up our vegetables and then we're going to add our sausage in there that looks good i can't wait to smell that all right all right so my oil is hot now i'm going to go ahead and add my peppers in there And my onions. All right, I always like to saute my onions and peppers first before I add the garlic. Ooh, why did that smell so good in there, y'all, already? All right, we're just going to soften these down just a little bit, and then we're going to go ahead and put in our sausage. Now, we're going to come over here and talk about the sausage for a second. All right, so with this, ooh, that was loud. <laughs> All right, with the sweet Italian pork sausage being like this, it's in a casing, all right? So there's a casing around it. So what you want to do is just take your knife and just kind of puncture it and then pull it down. And we just want to take the casing off, just like that. All right, can you see the casing? That's what we're pulling off. All right, so I added a little more oil to it. 
ahead and add our garlic that we minced up earlier. Give that a mix. And then I'm going to go ahead now and add our sausage to it. You just put it in there. Alright, we're going to go ahead now and just break that up. And we brown this up. Oh, it smells so good in there. Alright y'all, so I'm leaving the sausage in about pieces like that size right there. Alright, we want to be able to taste it. I'm not going to grind it up into small, tiny little pieces like ground beef. All right? So we're going to fully cook this and we're going to be right back as soon as I get it all browned up. Alright, so I got the jalapeno. Now I'm going to take about five slices off of it. That scared me a little bit. Me too. <laughs> the sausage is still cooking. Alright, so I'm going to leave everything on it just like it is. And then once the sausage comes out of the pan, we'll go ahead and put that in there to kind of heat this up and soften it up just a little bit before we put it on his pizza. Alright. Alright, I'm going to go ahead now and pour my sausage into a bowl. Y'all can see that. All right, I turned it off. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and put our jalapenos in into our pan here. All right, we're just going to saute those up just for a minute. And then we're going to build these pizzas. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and top it, the non bread right here that we have, with our pizza sauce. Now, I like a little more sauce than my husband does, so I'm putting it on mine. <laughs> load it up. Load it up. We're going to load this pizza up. Yes, you did hear him. <laughs> I'm a go. <laughs> All right. Oh, that looks really good. I like my sauce almost to the edge. I mean, almost to the edge. Yeah, you're a like, sauceaholic. I am a sauceaholic. <laughs> All right. Now on his, I'm going to scrape it off. <laughs> <laughs> That's not fun. All right. So he likes to barely know there's sauce on there. So do you like yours to the edge? Yeah, it don't matter. All right. He doesn't care. It's so. all going in my belly anyway. It is. Oh, my gosh. I'm so ready for some pizza. Mm -hmm. Homemade pizza. Well, almost homemade. <laughs> We're making it. Yep. All right. It's made in the home. So Is that, that looking good for you? Looks good to me. Let's see if he likes that. All right. Next, we're going to put on the cheese. Now, you don't have to skimp there. Oh, yeah. We're not skipping on the cheese. I love cheese. So, all right. Here we go. Mozzarella cheese. From Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. Everything today is brought to you by Trader Joe's. All right, I am not affiliated with Trader Joe's in any way. All right, y'all. We just like to shop there and we like the food there. <laughs> Sounded like a commercial to I know. me. <laughs> we don't want to say that. Oh my gosh, look how long that cheese is right there. Can y'all see that? Not anymore. Oh, that looks so fresh and soft. And no, they couldn't. They couldn't what? See it. Say that. Oh, y'all couldn't see that? You were oh, holding I'm it up sorry. too high. Oh. Mmm, that's good cheese. We're going to make this really cheese. I love cheese, cheese, cheese on my pizza. There's some big shreds on that cheese. Ooh, isn't there? All right, I think that's good. <laughs> Are you cleaning the pan? Look cheese. at that, y'all. Look right at there. that. Can y'all see that? Yeah, they, well, move it over a little bit towards you mine. See that? Oh, down. Well, way, <laughs> hey, 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 hey. All right, you just lost some Almost cheese. had it. Did y'all see that? <laughs> he was tricking me. Oh my God, did you see that? That's crazy. I almost oh. had that on there. He almost had that cheese on there. I fell for it. Almost. Almost. You're a little too <laughs> sharp today. <laughs> All right. Oh my gosh, y'all. I can't wait. And we still got more stuff to put on here. All right. What's next? Pepperoni or sausage with peppers? Which one Why do y'all want? Why not both? Which one do y'all want? Sausage and peppers? Or do y'all want... Pepperoni. Gourmet pepperoni. How about both is right. Yeah, that's what I say. Give me both. All right, y'all. So this is the gourmet pepperoni that we picked up from Trader Joe's. But any pepperoni will do, y'all. It is not a problem. Oh, look at that. All right. I'm going to pull some out of there. 
We both want it on the pizza. Mm -hmm. oh, look at that. Nice and thin. Yeah. Let me Mmm. That smells good. Want to try a piece? Mm-hmm. <laughs> look what I get, and you don't get none. Nope. I'm talking to the beagle. Oh, the beagle. <laughs> All right. Staring at me. Stop oh, staring at me. Put that pepperoni on there. All right, we've got a few more pieces here. Can save some room for that. There we go. That's looking good, y'all. All right. Tell the beagle to quit staring at me. Mm -hmm. And the beagle stares at you. It's like she's sucking my soul. All right, y'all, here's the sausage and the peppers and the onions with a little bit of garlic that we sauteed in our pan there. So we're going to go ahead and just plop it on there. Oh, man, that, right? that pepperoni is oh, good. Does that look good, y'all? All right, build your pizza. Build it, build it, build it. That's good. Is that good? That's mm -hmm. all you want? Yep. Oh, boy. More for me. I love sausage on my pizza. My favorite ingredient on pizza is sausage. Y'all comment down below what your favorite ingredient is on a pizza. I want to know. I want to know what to make for y'all going forward. All right? And pineapple doesn't count. <laughs> he doesn't like pineapple on there. All right. I'm thinking we're going to put a little more cheese just to kind of... Um, yeah, you got to solidify Solidify everything together so it doesn't roll off the pizza there. Don't forget my jalapeno. Oh, y'all. Almost forgot. We left these jalapenos in the pan over here. All right. You want yeah. them on the pepperoni? Yeah, that's fine. That's a good place for them. Sure. All right. Works for me. Can y'all see these jalapenos? Oh, yeah. Thanks. So. Can you see they're not going on my pizza? Nope. All right. Oop, I think we're just going to have just enough for every yep. pepperoni. Looky there we there. go. All right. Back with the cheese bag. I might have to get another piece of that pepperoni. That's all right. Good. Just a little bit. We just want to solidify there. We want to, we want to be able to see all the ingredients. Uh, Put a little bit right perfect. there. Right there. Right there. All right. I don't want the jalapeno falling off. Right there. Yep. Okay, cool. Thanks. Yeah, we don't want any. I don't thing. want any jumpers. Okay, no jumpers. Oh. All right, y'all. What do y'all think? All right, y'all. They are ready for the oven, which was preheating at 400 degrees. We're going to put these in around five minutes and check on them. And what we're wanting to do is make sure we get a nice golden color on that cheese and it's nice and melted. All right. We'll be right back as soon as I pull them out of the oven. All right, y'all. I just pulled these out of the oven. Oh, my gosh. They smell so delicious. All right, I'm gonna put these on the cutting board, cool these down just a little bit, and then we're gonna cut into them. All right, we're gonna go ahead and cut these pizzas. Mmm, oh, that looks good. Oh. All right. Mmm. That cheese on that one y'all <laughs> don't want to let go <laughs> all right i'm gonna try it for you So delicious when you caramelize those onions and the garlic and the peppers with the sausage it just adds another whole layer of flavor on your pizza all right oh, I'm ready to go eat my pizza I'm sure my husband is ready to go eat his pizza right now he's shaking his head yes back there all right y'all mmm do I have pizza sauce on my face I feel like I do but all right thank y'all so much for coming to my show today on non bread pizza we enjoyed making these for you. Comment down below, give me a thumbs up, share this recipe. If you like it, share it with others so that they can like it also. All right, y'all, I will see you on the next episode.